Yo, what's up YouTube? I am Jamesy, and today I'll be trying and reviewing the chicken pot pie from KFC. Now, I've never had a chicken pot pie before, so this KFC one is my introduction to them. To me, the concept of chicken pot pies, to simply put it, kind of seems weird. In my imagination on how a chicken pot pie was made, somebody was at a bakery board one day and decided, hey, I'm gonna throw my lunch into this pie crust, and then poof, out came the chicken pot pie. Now, I don't think a chicken pot pie is supposed to be sweet like a regular pie would. I just think it gets its name from the overall crust on the outside of it. Like right now, the only thing I smell is the crust of the pie, and I guess to describe that, it's kind of just like heavy on the toasted bread smell. Inside the pie crust, I believe I'm gonna find some chicken, of course. I mean, it's a chicken pot pie. It better have some chicken in here. But also some diced tomatoes, some carrots, some peas, which I'm not the biggest fan of peas. To me, peas are just kind of like a dried, green, stony green vegetable. And um, I'm not a fan of them. But also to go along with all of them ingredients, I believe there's some type of home style of sauce. And I'm gonna guess it's something similar to gravy, but I guess I'll find out here in a bit. Overall, when it comes down to the chicken pot pie, I just wanna see what the appeal is to this. To me, I don't understand it. It's always been like one of them weird food combinations that I wouldn't think about eating, but here I am for a YouTube video, so here we go. I'm gonna go dive right in. Okay, that crust is nice and thick, but also easy to get through. Oh man, the first thing I seen was a pea. But got my first little, first little scoop here. To me, it kind of gives off some casserole vibes, but here we go. Mm. So to me, it's like, initial reaction is this is just chicken noodle soup, just with the pie crust. Although at first sight I saw a pea, it actually isn't too bad. Oh my God, I got like three, four peas on here. Here we go. I had a nice piece of chicken there too. Hold on, this might actually be better, if not way better than I expected. Look at this bite right here. I got a little bit of everything. Got some carrots right there, even some peas. Looks like a good amount of diced potatoes and some chicken on the side. So here we go, big bites only. Oh God, I can vibe with this, this is okay. Now at the time of recording, it's like 70 or so degrees outside. I don't think this temperature is probably the ideal time to eat a chicken pot pie, but I can see myself in the winter, like maybe craving and wanting something different and getting a KFC chicken pot pie. Anyways, I'm going in for another bite. This bite contains a little bit of the creamy potatoes along with some of the pie crust. Here we go. Hmm. Looks like this bite is heavy on the chicken right there. I even got some pie crust on the top. Here we go. Yeah, that chicken in here is really good. All right, I'm going in for my last bite. I got a little bit of everything, but a little bit heavy on the carrots, so cheers. Oh my God, my mouth is a mess. Mm. And now for my overall thoughts on the chicken pot pie from KFC. I thought it was surprisingly really, really, really good. Coming into this, you guys know I wasn't really the biggest believer in the chicken pot pies, but my opinions and beliefs about the chicken pot pie were completely wrong. I think I mainly had those opinions because of the pie aspect of it. I was just kind of weirded out by the pie crust along with those inside ingredients, but those inside ingredients were really, really good. The main hitter for me is the creamy potatoes and the chicken. Those two are just, oh. Oh my God, like those two are just so good. And as for that creamy homemade sauce that was in here, the best way I can describe it is being just like a chicken Alfredo sauce, but it was really good as well. The chicken pot pie also contained carrots, which they were good, they did their part. But however, the peas in here, I mean, I don't have anything to say about them really. The peas played their role and they were okay. My mind was just focused on so many other flavors and ingredients that I didn't really care that they were there. So that's a positive. But as for the pie crust itself, I mean, I could do without it, but it's a chicken pot pie, so it's there, so I have to respect it. Is it actually good? I mean, like I said, I could do without it, but it's all right. At first, it kind of gives it that nice little hard texture of the bread when you dig your spoon into it, but if you're somebody who likes to eat like bread with your soup, then you'll love this. So if I had a final score for the KFC chicken pot pie, and I guess pot pies in general, I'm gonna go with an eight out of 10. Like I've been saying this whole review, the chicken pot pie was just simply good. Coming into this, I mean, as you guys have seen, all my expectations were completely blew out the water. But maybe I do think it's better than it actually is because I had so low expectations for it. But I just can't complain about the flavors here. If you haven't had a chicken pot pie and you're like me and you're kind of on the fence about them, 
I definitely think you should go try one. And the chicken pot pie from KFC is actually really good. So if you're someone like me and you don't want to cook them yourself, I know they come in the little packs at the grocery store, but if you're someone like me and you don't want to cook them, then the KFC one is a good choice for you. But that's all I got for you guys. So if you enjoyed this review, then please hit that like and subscribe button down below. Also comment if you've had a chicken pot pie before, and if so, what are your thoughts on them? Anyways, I've been Jamesy, and I'll see you next time. Peace.